Hey everybody, how y'all doing? It's Steve coming at you. Hope you're having a great day. Well, <laughs> Will and Jada, the drama and the saga continues. I don't know if you guys heard this, but the latest on that whole just totally effed up marriage. She has a video that she did, and, and, and this goes under the heading of Take the Hint. I'm going to put the video link in the description. But there's a video she did at Red Table Talk where she's on the Red Table. She's there with her mother, who they call Gammy, because she's also there with her daughter, Willow, and Will. Okay? All four of them are at the Red Table. And they're talking about their wedding day. And she admits that she never wanted to get married. And Will is laughing about this. And they're saying, well, we got married because Gammy was crying, which means her mom was crying saying, because she was pregnant. She was pregnant with Will's baby at that point, Jaden, Jaden uh, Smith. And the mom wanted them to get married because she was pregnant. And so they decided to get married, decided to have a wedding, but she did not want to get married. She says, she, she says in, the, in, in the interview, in the video, she never believed in the concept of marriage. And she cried all the way down the aisle. And Will Smith is giggling at this whole thing. And then the mom, Gammy, who's actually a very attractive woman, um, the, 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 the genes in that family run, run deep. The mom says to Will, well, did you feel the same way Jada did? And Will says, I have wanted to get married. I've known I wanted to be married since I was five years old. At which point Willow goes, wow. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Even the daughter gets it. <laughs> Even the daughter gets it. And Willow, as I understand it, when she was a, a child, there's a letter that came out. looks like it was written by a kid. Now, who knows how real it is? I'm, everybody's been saying it came from Willow. And it was a letter that she wrote to Tupac saying, I know you're alive somewhere. Would you please come back to my mommy? I'm sure if you came back, me and my mommy could be happy. Now, this is Will Smith's daughter writing to Tupac Shakur, who's dead, who, by the way, who died before she was born, years before she was born. And she's writing a letter to a dead man. So what was her mother putting in her head about Tupac at that time for her to be writing a letter to a dead man. So anyway, Willow's sitting there and she sat in on numerous of her mom's table talks. She sat in on another one where her mom talked about how Jada, the mom, talk, talked about how she was taught how to self-pleasure herself by her grandmother. And she was taught this, Jada, when she was nine years old. Her daughter, Willow, is listening to this. Now, this is an effed up family. This is an effed up family, no doubt. But I was talking to a guy earlier today and he asked me if I heard about the slap thing, which of course I've talked about numerous times in different videos. And I say, you know, Chris Rock is the man. I have a lot of respect for him. And he said that Chris Rock and Will Smith are both great men. I said, nah, nah fam, <laughs> nope. I used to believe that about Will Smith. I can no longer give him that mantle. And he said, well, he's done a lot of great things for the community. I just a brother who's talking to me about this. He said, he's done a lot of great things for the community. And I said, look, Adolf Hitler did a lot of great things in Germany. That didn't make him a good man. And he was like, wow. Now, was I calling Will Smith Adolf Hitler for slapping Chris Rock? No. My point was just because people do good things, and I said this to him, just because people do good things doesn't make them good people. Uh, you shall know them by their fruit. The Bible says that. Will Smith's got a son who says he's non-binary, dating some dude named Tyler, the producer. He walks around wearing dresses. This is the oldest son, Jaden. His daughter, Willow, who's also shaved her head, says that she is also non-binary, and I think she has a girlfriend. They only got two kids. They only got two kids together, and both of them are effed up. Will Smith's wife is banging her son's friend, August Lucino, a rapper. That's how the whole table talk started about the entanglement that she was in. Will, this is on you. I can't, I have to, I have to look at the fruit you've produced in your home. Just because you're a great actor doesn't make you a great person. 
I have to look at your fruit and your fruit is out there for the world to see. And it's not good, bruh. What you putting out, it's not good. So I just, y'all, somebody, that dude needs an intervention. Somebody, like I said before, needs to love him enough to say, bruh, you gotta let this go. But there's something that's very interesting. I remember uh, hearing that Will said at one point that he would rather die than, and, than not be married to die than to get divorced. See, Will has a God, like he talked about in his Oscar speech with God's calling on me to love people, but it's not the God we know. His God is Jada, because that's who he worships. So you can, again, you can't believe what people say, you gotta watch what they do. He worships the she-demon that he's married to. So he does have a God, it's just not our God. So everything that's happening to Will, I don't feel bad for him. <laughs> He chose everything that's happening to him right now. He chose it. So with that will, if you want that, you want that life, hey, you have at it, bruh. But I ain't gonna feel bad for you, and I don't think anybody else should. I, until you wake up, you deserve what you get. Y'all tell me what you think. If you agree, you disagree, please like the video, comment on the video, share the video, and please subscribe. I look forward to talking to y'all again soon. Y'all take care, and we'll always remember, let's go, Brandon.